another mastermind hit. Notice to all viewers and social media companies. Ohio residents can use medical marijuana for qualified medical conditions under Ohio House Bill 523. The host of the show, known as 420 Live or 420 Live Ohio, may use or consume legally purchased Ohio medical marijuana products during this video. 420 Live or Ohio Cannabis Live does not promote the use of illegal drugs. This content is for informative and entertainment purposes only. This content is not meant to be used as medical advice or to be used to promote misinformation about cannabis. Viewer discretion is advised. Another mastermind hit. What's up, what's up, what's up everybody, it's your boy Mastermind Prime here for Ohio Cannabis Live. Welcome back to another episode of For the 420 Live Show. And as always, what y'all medicating on? Let me turn my comments on. We should be streaming live on Facebook and YouTube right now at the same time. Let me just check everything out, make sure we're working here. Let's see. Well, hold on. Maybe we're not. Let's see. Okay. Wow. There's some comments coming in. Larry OG again. There, there, there it is. There it is. Okay, okay. We're getting ready to activate our third stream here. Just remember now, we're streaming on three platforms. We're streaming on OhioCannabisLive.com slash 420Live. We're streaming on YouTube Live. And we are also streaming on Facebook Live. Biomax, okay. Triple, triple Coco is 100. All right, all right. Okay, we're now streaming all the way across this. Can't nothing stop us. What's up, Mike? What's up? We live. We 420 live. You already know. Purple Urkel for me. Yeah. Okay. Okay, Lynette. All right. All right. We medicate now. We starting to get it going. Happy Friday, everybody. So we got a good show today. We got some really interesting news. Hey, Jeremy. That's a great question. Yes, Cresco does own the Sunnyside dispensaries. Correct. So you're already segueing into what today's show is about. If you read the title, you read it right. Cresco has sold part of their company to uh, rapper Puff Daddy Combs or P. Diddy. Whatever, however you know him. They said we won't stop. Biggie, give me one more chance. Juicy. And some more songs I could name. Yes, this is a huge deal. Up to $185 million, according to the Wall Street Journal. Pub Daddy will be operating out of three different states. Ohio was not one of them. As far as I know, anything could change. He'll have acts. He'll be running nine retail locations and three production sites. Now, when they say production sites, I don't know if that's cultivation, processing, or a combination of both. That information is a little bit vague. Obviously, we're wondering if Cresco did this to solve their Columbia Care debacle, because you know Cresco acquired Columbia Care or is acquiring Columbia Care which causes them to be in violation of the Ohio Medical Marijuana's program's rules about having 
no more than five active licenses. Yeah, I'm, I'm real happy with my GTI. I, I, I just had me some rhythm. LA Kush Cake. Puff Daddy. Well, you know, at the same time, you know, I think that uh, the, the more important thing right now is is this that you know more more people will have an opportunity to get in the space. I never thought it would be him. And that orange Kush cake, I was wondering, I was wondering how that how that was myself. So I, I'm interested in that conversation too, because I've been looking at that orange Kush cake, and I just I I don't know. I like orange flavored things, and I like Kush. And I like cake. So I've been thinking the same thing. So, yeah, Mike, tell me more. Tell us all. <laughs> yeah. What's up, then, Lizzie? Welcome back. So, you know... First of all, I mean, obviously, the, the next big thing will be is how this will how this will impact Ohio because, you know, Cresco, you know, I don't know how you feel. I, I really want to know how do you feel about Cresco products in Ohio? Do you think Cresco products in Ohio are good? Do you think they are terrible? Um, let me know in the comments right now whether you think Cresco products are good or bad, um, and then how do you compare them uh, with these other companies? I mean, I think that. You know, the company that we're all talking about right now in the comments, GTI, is doing a good job putting out some decent quality, especially if you uh, have tried the, the GTI uh, Rhythm line or the, the Good Green. Uh, I actually haven't tried the Good Green line, but I've tried several strains that they carry in both the Good Green and the uh, GTI Rhythm line. I mean, I still think the price could be better. Yeah, I mean, I've, I've bought in Cresco uh, a few times, once in the beginning of the program, once in the middle of the program, and a, a few other times. Um, but I, I bought a vape cart from Cresco. I bought some flour from Cresco, and uh, I I bought some batter from Cresco, which I think there is a there is a video on my channel about that, so you can go back and watch the review on the Cresco. I, I, I mean, I have a lot of gripes about Cresco's products, but I mean, at the end of the day, I mean, what I always care about is how how's it useful to help patients. And if it's not useful to help patients, then I mean, I don't have a lot of people that are telling me they bought specific things from them and they're helpful in some way. That's the kind of information that we would like to have um, because that would definitely be useful. Um, something I want to always remind everybody is that if you go to my website and go to reviews, this is an ongoing database here that everyone, anyone in the world for that matter has access to that we created ourselves. You and I and everyone else who's put information in here has created this database. And for that reason, no one has to log in to use this database there is no approval process I do not review your post this is configured in a way that it was only gonna let you say things and people have been really respectful and I appreciate everybody who's been putting in stuff on here because um, it's been very respectful and very useful even to me um, on some things that I had might not thought about and speaking of GTI at the top of the list and I had nothing to do with this there they are. Yeah, and I, and, I, and that's another thing that I would like to talk about um, is MSOs and and how you feel about um, someone in the entertainment business basically breaking up an MSO because that's really what's happening with the Puff Daddy venture here. They're breaking up a big MSO. I don't I don't know if you all realize how big Cresco really is. But Cresco is one of the biggest players in the game as far as legal cannabis in America. Um, they, they're on the stock market. Um, there's a lot. I mean, they might not be all that snazzy here, but in other states, they may be doing better. 
Um, but you know, GTI, I think they're they have Illinois and Ohio and maybe one of the plays. We'll have to look. But literally every company in our program, except for maybe like three or four of them, is an MSO now. I mean, we we're we're getting down to less. I, I would say it's probably less than five, maybe five that are just in Ohio, but other than that, and some of the ones, I mean, if you started your own company in Ohio and you were doing good, wouldn't you want to go somewhere else? Wouldn't you want to become a MSO? Wouldn't you want to be bigger than just Ohio? Wouldn't you want to operate in other locations? Yeah. So, I mean, that's the thing. Yeah, see, I, same here, Billy. I've heard, I've heard great things about Cresco. Uh, there as well, and and and, that, and that's you know very interesting in in itself. Um, so I don't know, but yeah, like I said, if you want to check out the reviews there, no pressure. It, like I said, you don't have to log in or anything. It, it's uh, OhioCannabisLive.com/slash/reviews. Um, also, want to remind you, if you want to go to the next part of this show, which is the offline version, we've got something new going on. I'm testing it out today. So when you go to the page, uh, 420Live, uh, OhioCannabisLive.com slash 420Live, you're going to see that uh, we're currently streaming live here. But there should be a button there. there there's going to be a button there. And that button is going to let you join live. I don't know why I don't see it there. Hold on, let me see something log out. I think it's just doing that. Bit. Yeah. So when you go there... I'm going to get an echo. See, I, I'm live here. Just so you know, this is working. I don't know how much delay we have. <laughs> but it is kind of funny. So, you can click this join. And this is going to launch Google Meetings. And when you do that, you'll just join Google Meetings. Just like that. So, you can either join it just and watch, or you'll be able to uh, actually just uh, join the meeting and, and come in. But you won't be on the screen, so don't worry about that. We're not, you know, we're not doing it like that. So you're like in a live audience, the camera that the TV folks can't see, basically. Yeah. OhioCannabisLive.com slash 420Live. Bookmark that page because that's going to be a very important page. You go to that page and, uh, you know, you'll definitely be in there. Now, uh, you know, if you're looking for a way to check your days and you don't feel like typing out that ridiculously long address that they got for the website, all you got to do is go to my site and click on check your days. And it's going to tell you right there, you can log in, check your days. So if you're in a hurry at the dispensary, you're in a line, and you're trying to hurry up and check your days or whatever, just go to my website and click on the link. It's one button. You don't have to type it. If you can spell Ohio Cannabis Live, then you don't have to worry about nothing else. If you're looking for the menus, I got them all on my site. I got one button that takes you to all the menus in the whole state. You don't never have to type in Google nothing. That's over. Watch. One button. All of them. I can't make it no easier for you. I can't make it no easier. <laughs> so make sure you check out OhioCannabisLive.com. Make sure you sign up. Make sure you download our app. Yeah, we got an app in the Play Store. And I th All you got to do is go to the Play Store on your phone. Actually, you ain't got to do that. When you, go to your, when you go to our website on your phone, what's actually going to happen is there's going to be a box that pops up that's going to 
remind you to, to get our app. Yeah. And then you hit go, go to app. Yeah. We got an app. And we ain't done yet. <laughs> exactly, Jimmy. Exactly, my brother. Exactly. Add it to your home screen. Just go boom. Ohio Cannabis Live isn't just a video guy of a guy out here doing reviews. This is a resource to patients in the program. This is information. This is education. This is uh, a safe space for you to medicate into. Um, this is us, to, you know, trying to uh, avoid any type of weird censorship about cannabis. You know, I, I'm, YouTube beats me up every week. They're going to beat me up today. I probably already got age restricted, man, just for me talking. So it it's really hard to do these videos, but that's all right. Because we can keep going here. We don't need their platform. Hey, Terry. Thanks for joining us. You know, we're just all just taking it all in that, you know, uh, rap moguls are now going to be running the program. <laughs> I can't wait to see what's going to happen next now. Is Cresco going to change? I mean, Columbia, yes, Columbia Carrier going to change the name of the dispensaries to the Biggie Shop? I don't know what's going to happen. It's going to be very interesting times in Ohio for sure. Okay, you like the you like that giant tub behind? Okay. I was curious about that product. Do you think it was a good price on that? You think the price was reasonable for that? Canavasitor <laughs> Great question, Tyler Baker. Great question. How does Mr. Mike Tyson feel about the P. Diddy J? I don't know. Maybe they talked about it. Maybe they didn't. But that's a great, that's a million dollar question, Mr. Baker. That has really got me wondering that. That's that's interesting. So before we, okay, some Kim Fuego, okay, that yeah, okay, that's some good stuff there. Before we wrap up today's show on the YouTube and the Facebook, we are going to ask. We ask you every Friday, what's for dinner? What you got the munchies for? We're having steak tonight. We haven't for made me young tonight. Homemade. Because we've been eating some other stuff the last couple days, and it's been terrible. Oh, my goodness. Stomach stuff still hurting from stuff we've been getting. Oh, yeah. I'm, you know, I'm sure there's going to be something. Uh, I mean, you know, I, I've been buying a lot of Mike Tyson stuff lately. Uh, I've really been enjoying that biscotti mints. It's really been pretty good. Fast food, yeah. See, I, I'm trying to have a break from that, Jeremy. I'm trying to take a break from the fast food because, I mean, it's starting to really mess with my stomach. Goulash. I haven't heard or had that, like, in 20 years, then, Lizzie. <laughs> goulash? Wow, that, that, that that's super old school throwback right there. Goulash. Wow. I mean, dang, you take, you taking it back to the old school, aren't you? Uh, he said remodeling, so he got some Popeyes. Woo, I, I pray, I'm going to pray for your stomach. How'd you feel about that Midwest toe? Did you like it, Tyler? I I haven't tried it yet. I mean, it's on my list. I've only had the uh, Tiger Mints and the Biscotti Mints. 9.99 from Mike. <laughs> yes, Goulash. He said yes. <laughs> Oh, man, that's too funny, man. The old school. <laughs> Mike showing me up. <laughs> hey, how you doing, Mashana? Hey, long time, I don't see you. I've seen you in a while. 
no, 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 no. Popeye sandwiches? No. No. Not, not the Popeye sandwiches. I've heard all kinds of scary nightmares about the Popeye sandwiches, so I'm just like... I don't know. I'm a little bit afraid of that. I'm a little bit afraid of that. Man. <laughs> Would you hold on? What'd you say, Jeremy? Wait a minute. Let me go back. Oh, that's right there. Let me see. Jeremy said. Wingsuit or runts by Chisel Cure Ohio Germ. That that's what I would say, man. If you can catch that at the right thing, at the right spot, that's, that's what I would highly recommend. Super chat. Today? You did a super chat today? Hold up. No. Let me see. Oh! Hey Mike! Thanks, Mike, for the nine ninety nine, man. I didn't even see that. Okay, I, look, see, it came up weird on the screen. No, Jimmy, I didn't get your super chat. Hold up, you sent it. To, oh, wait, there it is, Jimmy. Okay, I got it. Thanks, Jimmy. Thanks, Mike. I really appreciate that. Yes, and then I want—I definitely want you to let me know what you think, Jeremy. Definitely, definitely, give me your feedback on it if you like it. Thank y'all. We, we might have just broke another record. All right, all right. We're going to break this. We're going to bust this algorithm all the way up. I'm telling you, look at that. Chat revenue, $11.99. Let's see. They're, they're going to probably give me a dollar out of that. But I, I'm going to definitely update y'all and let you know how much they give it to me once it settles in there. They usually, they usually suck out, like, all of it. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I think, I, I think they'll give me, like, $8. Hey, hey, that's right. There it is. Another mastermind hit. Who knows what I might do for $20. <laughs> y'all be out here. I'm mean, like, look, man, listen, I just need y'all. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But, you know, this is great, man. I really appreciate y'all supporting me, man. I really do. It's, man, it's too, it, be, it means a whole lot. It really does. Keeps me going. Cause some days I'd be like, "How am I gonna do this show?" I'm just like, I, I, "Man, I got different chairs. I got to switch chairs. I think I to switch back to my other chair because this chair is killing my back right now." Anyway, I'm going to switch up. Uh oh, Jimmy just sent another dollar. Is that is that is that this is dollar from Jimmy? Let me see. Okay, Jimmy, thank you, my brother. So yes, we are we are going to switch off from the uh, main live streams now, and we're going to the after show. So we, we have start shutting these down, so make sure you go over to four ohiocannabislive.com slash 420 live. So we can still keep the conversation going. And everybody else watching on Facebook, I'll see you next time. We're now stopping the Facebook stream. And everybody, uh, on the YouTube stream, we'll see you on the other stream, and everybody else, we'll see you in a minute. Okay, yes, yes, I'm gonna be putting out some new products on the site, some custom stuff, and I can't wait to show that to you. So we'll, we'll definitely be talking about that. Hey, Cat Claw, make sure you follow us on the other line. We're going over to uh, howcannabislive.com/slash420live. I'll see you there. I'm still there. I'm here right now, actually. 